Okay, so I think I finally got everything that I need to go ahead and like revamp the kids' bathroom. I've been wanting to do this for such a long time and I just buy things and then I let it sit there and then I don't finish buying things, but I think I have everything that I need to just do a super cute little um, summer revamp in their bathroom. It definitely needs it right now. It's just so boring and it just doesn't spark joy. So we're going to hook it up and get it all Florida-ish. I'm going for like a summer beach Florida vibe and it's going to be amazing. <laughs> I went for this vibe because we live in Florida and this vibe is so uplifting and fun and super cute. I love the flamingos and the palm leaves. I'm obsessed. So I hope everything here turns out cute. I think it will. If not, we'll be buying some more things, but I think I'm set. Let's go through the things that I've purchased so that we can go ahead and start decorating. I'm just going to show you guys everything one by one and just tell you where I bought it from. So from the first time that I knew I was doing this theme, I knew I wanted to find some cute little small pink flamingos to incorporate into their bathroom. And I found them on Amazon and they are so cute. I don't know exactly what I'm going to poke them in, but they are definitely going into the kid's bathroom for decoration. And then this pineapple standing light came from Amazon also. And that's going to be so cute on one of the shelves that we're hanging up. And then down here I got the pineapple shower curtains that came in a pack of 12 on Amazon as well. And then these two solar dancers here, these came from the Dollar Tree. How freaking cute. I was just standing in line and I seen them and I decided to grab them because that can go on the little shelf that I'm putting in their bathroom. Um, and then I got these stickers from Target. Um, I might be able to use some of these on something, but I wanted to see if I can incorporate them in there because they're so cute. Look at those stickers. These come in a pack of 24 and they were $4.99 at Target. But they are so cute. Look at some of those designs on there. Or the graphics. And then I just got another one of these for the bathroom. Of course I had to get it like a summer theme smell so I got the summer delights. And then I got some kinetic sand and you're going to see what I do with this but it's going to be so cute. I can't wait to hook up their bathroom. I'm so excited for them to come home from their grandparents house tomorrow and see that it's all done. And then I just threw these umbrellas in here. I think I can use these somehow but if I don't whatever but I think these would be super cute to incorporate them somehow. And then I got this passion fruit and banana flower um, foaming soap from Bath and Body Works. These came from our local Publix grocery store. You could find these anywhere. Same with these. And then I got a kitchen towel. This was at the Dollar Tree. I just seen it and I decided to grab it. I don't know if I'm really going to use it because I hate this type of bath towel material. It feels so cheap and I feel like it just water repels off of it rather than soaking it up. So um, I might just be able to use this for some kind of decor. I don't know yet, but I picked it up because it was only a dollar. And it had flamingos on it, so it's going with, like, my theme here. So um, that's why I grabbed this. And then I had to get another one of these fabric shower liners for their bathroom. They need it really bad. And then I got this plastic cup. This came from Home Goods down here in Florida, so it's plastic. I figured I'm going to use it for the kids' toothbrushes instead of just getting, like, a... Um, a formal toothbrush holder because I didn't find any that were like super fun that match like this vibe. So I found this cup at Home Goods the other day and I was so glad that it was plastic because when I first seen it from afar it looked like glass. And when I seen that it was plastic I was like, oh yeah, that's definitely going to be their cute little tooth hold, um, toothbrush holder. And then I got a two pack of the napkins. I don't... This might be for decor more than anything and for them like to not use, but I thought it was so cute with the pineapple and it matches the shower curtain that I have that I just washed. They've already had a pineapple shower curtain in their bathroom for the longest time. So I just threw it in the wash and then I'm going to incorporate some more pineapples. So cute. Hence the pineapple, hence the pineapple, hence the pineapple. <laughs> So we got a pineapple flamingo theme going on, and I'm so here for it. And then this is, um, how many come in here? An eight pack of washcloths. So cute. I thought these colors were so fun. And then I got this towel, this beach towel from Marshalls. It was like $12.99. And then this we've had. I think I got this from either Michael's or Joann's a long time ago but I figured I could use it in there because it gives like the palm vibe. 
I think I might want to do something else with the base though because I don't want this black base is like killing the colorful vibe here so I might have to paint this bottom portion of this cute little fake tree and then these are two acrylic uh, shelves that I got off of Amazon and I'm gonna have Tony hang these up because I'm not about to use the drill and drill holes in the wall today so he can do that part and then I picked up this cute sign it says endless summer it's in the shape of like a surfboard so cute it's definitely like Hawaii vibes and then I got this sign as well so cute with the surfboards going with the same cool dude summer theme I love it and then I got some artificial palm leaves off of Amazon I forget how much these were, but I think they were like $15. But I figured this isn't going to go to waste. This isn't going to be a waste because um, Layla's fifth birthday party this year, I believe we're doing Moana. I believe we're settled with that. We've changed it so many times already because she keeps changing her mind. But I think we're sticking with Moana. And if we do do Moana theme, this is perfect because then I can use this as like table decor. I could use this somehow in her Moana party so um, that was my thought on getting those and then I grabbed this uh, Beach Life bath mat from Target online so cute it's by the SKL home and then there's another one here from Target that fell it's the pillow fort brand I believe yes um, so the pillow fort brand this is the striped bath rug so cute so I got two more bath rugs for in there. I just threw the ones that we had out. Once I, I feel like once they get so wet so many times, it's just throw them out. Throw them out. I'm so scared of like mildew and just get rid of it. Um, so that is everything that I purchased to revamp their little bathroom for summer. I hope everything comes out cute. I don't yet have any idea where I'm putting anything. We're just going to figure it out together. If you want to see how it turns out, just keep on watching. Is their current bathroom situation right now we already had the pineapple theme going but I just really wanted to elaborate on it and make it more like beachy fun vibes with the pineapples um, so we also already had a shower curtain I just took that down and I washed that and that is their old fabric liner so I'm about to take that off and put the new one on and get this place looking much better than it does right now <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of just boring and plain right now. It doesn't really have any fun accessories or no fun accents to it. So um, we're going to go ahead and hook it all up. I'm thinking you were made for me. It's in my birthday yet, cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night I love how it looks These little pineapple shower rings are so freaking cute I don't know why I didn't have these on here earlier That's nuts It's crazy how much one little accessory makes a big difference Like compared to the little clear rings that I had on here before. Oh, I'm obsessed. But we had a little bit of a snag. The uh, pineapple shower curtain only has 10 ring holes and you're supposed to have 12. I think the standard is 12 because the shower liner, this fabric shower liner had 12 holes. So um, 
but it kind of worked out because it's a good thing that the shower liner that I have is fabric because it just kind of picks up where the shower curtain leaves off instead of looking awkward with like a plastic shower liner sticking out the sides. So it worked out.
moved in here, we had this like black spot on the mirror and I don't know what that is from, but since we don't own this house, we're not gonna bother replacing it. <laughs> so we're just gonna leave it just like that. And I think I might like stick a leaf over it just to kind of cover some of that because it's really an eyesore. So let's see how this works. Put one right here. And then And this, what I'm using, this is just um, double-sided like foam tape, 3D tape. I don't know what the hell you call it. I don't know what the proper name is. This will help us cover this right here. I guess that just comes from the mirror being old. I don't know. Who knows? And then I already washed out this cup and took off the sticker. So that is going to be a cup for the toothbrushes. <clears throat> and put some seashells here. There we go. On the run from my given disaster. definitely gonna hang these back up on the wall but I think I'm going to add some paint to them add some more like tropical colors because I feel like they with all the colors going on I feel like these aren't colorful enough so I'm just gonna paint some different colors on these and then I'm going to hang them up over here on this wall so I'm just gonna go ahead and slap some paint on and probably finish this bathroom up tomorrow. And I'm gonna go ahead here and take this down and paint this also. So I have two things to paint before this bathroom is all complete. the carpets around I think I like that striped one over there underneath the shower curtain better and then this beach life one over here I think I like that better all right we're gonna get ready to go ahead here and paint the bottom base of this little plant stand that I stuck the flamingo in <laughs> And we're also going to paint these. I'm just going to add more splashes of color inside here. And we're going to see how it works out. And I really don't even like the gold, so I think I'm going to try and cover up the gold that's on here. It's like a metallic -y gold, and I hate it. So we're going to see how we can alter these canvases to better match the bathroom. 
Let's go ahead and do it. These are the paint colors that I'm picking here. Lots of vibrant, summery paint colors going on. We got Tropical Blue, Key West, that's my favorite. I think just the name is awesome. Concord Grape, Apricot, Fuchsia, Spring Green, and Bright Yellow. Let's do it.
bathroom is all complete. I just did a cute little overview showing you guys everything, how it turned out. I hope you guys like this video. I am absolutely obsessed with the kids' bathroom. I wish I would have done it sooner because it was just so blah before and now it totally has the vibes when you come in here. Um, so much so that I don't want the kids to come in here. They're going to be touching stuff on the shelves. They're going to be making this bath mat all wet. There's going to be rags on the floor. I don't want them to come in here and ruin it. I want it to stay just like this. But we all know that that's not going to happen. So let's all suck it in while it looks pretty. I'm going to take it in and just keep coming in here and looking around for like the next 20 minutes before they come back from their grandmother's house but it was nice while it lasted. Um, I hope you all liked this video. If you did like this video and you like how everything turned out, definitely give me a thumbs up. Let me know how you like this video and leave a comment and let me know what your favorite part of it is. Is it the palm leaves? Is it the little flamingos? Is it the shower curtain? Let me know. I think it's the shower curtain. This pineapple guy is so cool. Um, but I will see you guys in my next video.